Okay, so here we go on assembling this uh, flower arrangements. So what we're gonna do first is we're gonna take each one of these flowers and I wanna put the leek in there first. And I use the flat end of the uh, skewer into the leek so it doesn't slide down. And then I put the sharp end into the melon. I'm gonna keep this kind of in the background here. Nice tall element and I'm gonna, gauge, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna assemble all around it. So you're not gonna ever really see the skewer. I'm gonna use my next biggest thing which is the bell pepper. And uh, in this one, I'm gonna use the point to go into the blossom end of the bell pepper. And once again, kind of pick an angle, keep it right close to the other flower. And by grouping these close together, you're gonna to hide the skewers. And your arrangement's gonna look pretty nice. Then the next thing I'll do is I'm gonna work with uh, all one color. And so I'll keep all my colors grouped together so that they, um, stand out, break the skewer a little bit there. And I'm gonna go with all the yellows. So you're just sticking them all in the watermelon? I'm putting them all in the watermelon. Just breaking down the uh, skewer just a little bit so that each one comes down a little bit further. All right, so I have all of my yellow in there, and then I'm gonna come in with the green. You probably want to do it the day of. You could keep them in the water until you, then. You prep the flowers the day before? Yeah, and the flowers are good for about a week in the water. And when we're done with the presentation, you can take the flowers off the presentation and then use them again the next day. So it, it does, there is some multi-uses to it. So there's all of my greens. And then I'm going to come in with the uh, oranges, the carrots. had a one small spot that I wanted to fill in but I'm still going to try grouping the orange flowers together and then as I get further down and I want to kind of fill in I'm going to go with some of the larger ones again kind of making the background colors. I'm putting the skewer up the side of the bell pepper here so it kind of holds off a little bit on the side like that. Then we're just gonna stuff in some of the, the leeks. And then the ones that um, are the hardest, you want to put in a place where you can see them.
Okay, and that's the finished arrangement. So you can see a lot of the skewers in the back, but actually, you know, there is some frisee up there on that tray, and you could stuff that frisee in the back, and that would help hide some of the, uh, the clutter of all those skewers. 